Hello everyone, how are you? So today I've had a, a little request on how to actually power close a position on C Trader. Okay. So first and foremost on C Trader, see where it says new order, then you have this left tab and then the right tab here. Now if we look at this, I have one to turn off, turned on, if I turned it off then as well. So when I'm placing trades, I always have this active panel on the right hand side opened. Now, if I want, I can close this one down here. So it means I have full full um, coverage on my graph. Uh, and if not, then I'm, I'm using this here. So just imagine this is a demo account. So this is just literally a little video to show people how to par close a trade. So at this present moment in time, I'm going to buy Euro USD. So we can see the quantity here is eight lots. What I've done is I'm buying at market. So buy at market so that's instant in the trade I, i'm putting in a stop loss because i'll always put a stop loss in when i'm trading now if i have 10 grand on my accounts then i should be risking 100 quid so this says here that i'm risking 112 pounds uh on on my account so theoretically that should be slightly lower so i click on this here and that brings that down there. So 97 pounds, 99 or 98 quid. So that's where it should be. But for the sake of maths, I'm going to leave it here at eight because it's going to be more beneficial having eight lots here than seven. So I'm going to do it that way. So I'm a little slightly bit more than that I would normally trade. No need for a take profit on this because this is literally just for demonstration purposes. So my stop loss is at this horizontal level. So I put this level in here just to work out where my stop loss was. My stop loss is below this low. Now, again, this is not a real trade. It is a, it is a, a trade just so we can actually show you how to park close positions. But that is still below the previous low. So that is either there or there would be the two areas for our stop loss. So I'm going to place this order now. So order is now placed. And I can see here this little SL. It's telling me that I'm risking 113 pounds. It tells me here that I'm getting in with eight lots, so on so forth. So that's telling me where I'm looking to jump in with my trade. Now, if I go up here to the top again and I activate the window at the bottom, this tells me the trade is opening right here. So it's running right here. It's going. Now, if I want to cancel that trade, I can just press the X here and it gets rid of the rid of the trade. I can press the X down here, it gets rid of it. Or I can drag my stop loss above my entry and that will close it as well. Either or will we'll close the trade. Now there's a couple of different things you can do here as well, but probably the easiest way to actually par close a position is if you double click on this, okay? This little window here, tab comes up. Now, just imagine we have we're in profit. Just say we're in profit here of a hundred quid, and I want to I want to close say fifty quid in profit. What I would do is see this here, the initial lot size. I would bring this lot size down to four. So that's four, and now it says close zero dot zero four lots of eight. So it means I'm closing half it. So you can see here that I was risking one hundred thirteen quids. Uh, I'm now £1.60 in negative. The minute I close this here, press OK. Now look, I'm only 98p in negative. Okay. If I put my mouse on my stop loss, it says now minus 56 quid. Okay, so it's halved. If I go to uh, history, we can see here that this one here is closed. This here is closed. And if you can see, I did a test one just to make sure before I recorded it. But that's that there. That's it's literally closed half of there. Okay. And that means the other half is running. Now, as this is only a test, I'm going to close this here as well. Just press the X and get rid of it. And that's it closed. And that's how you would part close a position on, on C Trader. Pop that back up. Now at this particular point, I'll turn this off because I don't need it anymore. And then just continue with my with my uh markets that I'm watching. Okay. Hope this helps anyone that has uh, wants to come in and actually see the trading floor in Mayfair. Don't be afraid to come down and see it on 105 Piccadilly uh, or give me a shout on contacts at henry-ward.co.uk. Thanks very much. Bye-bye.